hello guys welcome back to the video and in this video i will show you how you can improve your fps in your unreal engine editor and we will improve the fps inside the unreal engine editor and outside the unreal engine editor so as you can see we are getting around 14 fps on average we are going to improve it to 100 fps so to do this first uh, most common way to improve your fps is to go to your settings and under engine scalability settings you can lower your graphics settings to high medium low according to your pc and uh, you can also lower the resolution scale so that you can get better fps now let's see how many fps we can get so as you can see we can almost get 23 fps from us uh, 14 fps on average so we improved 10 fps almost so there are more settings that we can apply to get more better fps now uh, the one of the best settings that i can tell you that nobody tells in other tutorials that first go to your project settings now go to the android section here under platform and just check on first uh, there will be a configuration button just configure now and then under the builds go to support Vulkan and just check it and restart the editor so after you restarted your editor just go under settings and go to preview rendering level and select android Vulkan. after clicking that option for the first time uh, you will have to compile some of the shaders and after all the shaders have been compiled you can see a really drastic change in your fps like you can see we are getting around 60 fps uh, 50 60 fps easily so this is a very good option even for the PC developers because it is just a preview option that will not affect your project so you can switch to PC render by just clicking that Android Vulkan option at the top and you can see uh, our FPS uh, dropped again so uh, just while editing or level designing you can turn on that option so that you can get a good FPS and one thing to keep in mind that whenever you will import or create any material just check that material in your default pc render because sometimes it uh, it looks different in uh, your android vulkan so yeah and uh, next thing you can do to improve your fps or performance in your editor is go to your display settings or if you use any graphic card you can go to that panel and uh, uh, you can lower your resolution like we are going to use this one uh, like I personally use 1616 to 900 and uh, we are going to use 1280 into 720 yeah because we can get better FPS you can always change the resolution according to your PC specification as uh, as much FPS you want okay so after you changed your resolution you can see uh, yeah we are getting really good fps like 100 fps so yeah this is a really important tip that you can follow to increase your fps and whenever you need to build your light just turn off your android vulkan option and uh, build the light manually So our light has been built now let's switch to Android Vulkan and as you can see we are getting 100 FPS very easily and as you will turn off that option we are getting half the FPS like 50 FPS on average. So uh, you can really see the impact now we have doubled the FPS and that's a really uh, good option you can try. Uh, the next thing you can do is to turn off all the background applications that are not in use so go to start button and search for background apps now you can see all the background applications that uses all your uh, CPU usage so turn off them manually or simply you can turn off by uh, this button all of them will close 
so you don't have to do it manually now uh, the next step you can uh, follow that is you go to task manager and go to your startup and now disable all the unnecessary files or the application that runs uh, uh, at the startup so just right click and disable the next thing you can follow is to go to your properties of this PC and after that go to advanced system settings and click on settings again and you can uh, uncheck all the unnecessary animations fade out effects and all those stuff manually or just click on adjust for best performance to get the best performance of your PC after that apply and click on ok and then you can see that your PC uh, will run very fast you uh, you can see we can open close any window very quickly and close it very quickly the some of the dis disadvantages of this is that you can't see the image by its thumbnail okay so let's go back to our editor and uh, you can see we are getting really good fps you can also uh, adjust the graphic settings according to your need and yeah we started from 14 fps and we ended up with 120 fps and that's a really good improvement uh, now i hope this video helped you out if it did then please click that like button and subscribe to my youtube channel and support me for my uh, future videos and uh, yeah that's all for this video thanks for watching this video uh, till then see you bye bye